السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على رسوله الأمين وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين Just want to say a quick word about fasting and Ramadan which is the month where we try our best to get close to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala The question is why did Allah choose to, to command us to abstain from eating and drinking in order to get closer to Him So what is the relationship between not eating, not drinking and excelling in acts of worship? The scholars have a very nice statement. They say that when the stomach is hungry, the rest of the body parts become full. And when the stomach becomes full, the rest of the body parts become hungry. So if you think about that, for example, someone is starving. And while they're starving, do they have time, do they have any concern besides filling their stomach? Are they concerned with anything else? Do they have time to backbite, to get the latest gossip, or to talk about people behind their back? or to do any kind of haram thing. Because when the stomach is hungry, the rest of the body parts become full. The eyes are full, he doesn't want to look at haram. The tongue is full, he doesn't want to talk about people behind their back. The ears are full, he doesn't want to eavesdrop because the stomach is hungry. Now when the stomach is full, then you have time for nonsense, for backbiting, for rumors, for gossip, for all kinds of things, for the lusts and desires that suddenly sprout out of nowhere. So for that reason, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, out of His wisdom, He chose to, He commanded us to stop eating and drinking so we can now be free, the other body parts are full, and now put extra effort and energy into worshipping Allah Azza wa Jal. That was the intent. Now we ruin it because the idea is we leave food and drink so we can worship and, and focus on Allah, but we leave food and drink and then we engage in what I call the countdown to iftar. So then you're like, four hours to iftar, we're almost there, three hours to, we're going to do this thing, two hours to iftar, 30 minutes to iftar. <laughs> so like the whole day now we're just thinking about when we're going to eat. And that's why people gain weight in Ramadan and all kinds of things go bad because of that. So the idea is to leave the food and drink and be able to focus on worshipping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That was the original intent, inshallah azza wa jal, this Ramadan. Let's not ruin that. Let's keep it for the sake of Allah Azza wa Jal. Let's keep the food and drink aside and focus as much as we can, inshallah. And ask Allah Azza wa Jal to accept from you. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.